Hello. Today we will create a bootable disk for Big Sur. Uh, so you can boot uh, from, like, you know, if you want to install uh, Mac OS on different drive or if you want to reinstall it in your existing drive, but you will be using a bootable disk. Uh, and our, uh, in here, uh, so what I did, I downloaded uh, Big Sur. That's the first thing we have to do. So if we look under applications, and we go down to, should have it in here. Okay, here it is. Install Mac OS Big Sur. So the first thing that we need to go to the App Store and download Big Sur or uh, Mojave, Catalina, High Sierra, or El Capitan. Now the second thing we need, it's an SD card. Uh, or an external drive, at least the size, this has to be 14 gig. And we need to format it with uh, extended journal. Uh, so if you see in here, I have, this is my SD card, it's empty. So what we will do, we will format it first, and then we, we start uh, the process to create the bootable disk. So to do that, to format the drive, we need to go to Disk Utility. So either we can go to the Spotlight by uh, Command and the Spacebar. Then we search for Disk Utility. Or you can go to the Disk Utility from Application, going all the way down to Utilities, expand it, then Disk utility, this is it. So this is like a shortcut to use. In here, so this is our SD card, 16 gig, and we will format it. We will uh, erase it first. So we click on erase, and let's name it for something simple. So I will name it for as boot, because we would need to type this name shortly, I will show you. And we want it to be, so in here in the drop down, expat or for Windows. So in here we want it to be extended journal. And then we'll hit erase. Now it's erasing the drive. <clears throat> okay, so it's done. So we can close this utility. And as we see in here, this is it, okay? Now to, because there's a long command, we will be using the terminal to create the bootable disk. We need to search for um, how to create a bootable disk for a Mac. Uh, how to create bootable disk. Or Mac. Okay, and so this is the latest one, Apple. Now in here, so this is is showing you how to do that. Now, if you want to install Big Sur, this is the full command. That's the one we need to copy, and here's those the commands for every single one of those Mac OSs. Uh, to so the first thing we need to do we need to copy this command but before we do that all the way at the end do you see where does it say my volume we need to replace this one with the name for our uh, SD card so mine I name it uh, boot so we can for me the best way I do it is I copy the whole thing And then I open, in case uh, there's one I already created in here before. If we said like, let's create another one. I do in here and I delete this one, my volume. And instead I type boot, which is the name for my SD card. Then I copy this one. Now the Mac OS, this has to be under application. We're not supposed to change it 
to any other location. So it has to stay in here because this is the path where the process is going to uh, look for. It has to stay under application, as you see. Now we need to go to terminal. So we click terminal. The same thing, terminal, you can access it from utilities on here. This is it under application or I always use a spotlight to search for it. It's much easier. And in here we will paste that default command. So you do not need to type it and then we hit enter. Now it's asking us for the password. This is the password for your Mac. Okay. And in here, if we want to wish to continue, we hit the Y. And now it's to start erasing. Now this process, it could take like, you know, a uh, few minutes. So if this will take a longer than that, I will, uh, I will speed up the video. Okay, so I'm back. Uh, as we see, it's already the process is done and no error messages. Now, when you what you will notice here, if we go to the name for the SD card, now it's changed to install macOS Big Sur. So instead of boot, that's what it is. And this is the full process. I have my MacBook Pro 2019. It's Intel uh, chipset. So to get to the uh, boot option, if you hit the power button, then keep tabbing on the option key. Uh, if it's the right side or the left side, it's the same thing. And just keep tapping. On. So you will see the big Sur installation and my internal uh, Macintosh HD. If you have any question, please leave it in the comment below. And if you feel this tutorial is helpful, please give me a like and subscribe. And see you in the next one.